Hello, hello, hello. We're back, we're back, we're back. We're tired, we're tired, we're tired. You know, just three minutes ago, I'm like, are we going on? Are we going on? Are we going on? Oh my gosh. I took a shower and I'm like, I'm going to bed. <laughs> She's like, no, let's go on for a couple of hours. And I know once I got here, I'd be happy that I was here. <laughs> so hi, everybody. Welcome back. Some of you for the third time today. Thank you so much. Sundays is a big day for T and I. We so appreciate you guys coming back time and time again. You're awesome. <laughs> Thank you, Virginia. Virginia's first. Are you home, honey? I hope you're home and not working. I mean, legitimately, there's already 60 people here. How awesome are you guys? Right. Second, Thank but you. heading for supper since we'll be a while. Okay. Well, hopefully we'll be still be on when you come back from, from Din Din Din. KK's third. Hello. Hasn't changed your picture. She did days ago. Oh, I missed it. How come it didn't come up on my it didn't come up on my screen like that this afternoon? It didn't? No. She's gonna go and listen to some music now. Sounds like a good plan. Hi, Perlini. Perlini Hi, changed her picture. Hi, Beautiful rainbow. Eating dinner now. She's eating dinner now and having coffee. I didn't even eat my dinner yet. <laughs> T. Scott is fifth. I didn't either, actually. Fifth in the chat. I was bad because when we got off before, I had to run out because it was my niece's birthday. So I just grabbed a zone bar and I wasn't hungry. And now I'm going to be hungry. <laughs> yeah, that's all right. We won't stay on that long. Our famous final words. Hi, right? Janine. <laughs> Three hours later. I know. Thank you so much for being here, Janine. Thanks for the help. If you can help us. Hello, Countess April. April. Sandy Kirk, hey, 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 ho, ho, ho. Who's she calling a ho? Who's Sandy? she calling a ho? Sandy? <laughs> oh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Who else is here? Joanne, hi. Good evening. And Ginger Ann, so nice to see you, sweetheart. Thanks for coming in. She's like, um, I'm still here. Someone's late getting ready to go out to dinner. She's waiting on someone. Susan Arrington, O'Donna, and T. James Cisco, he's list he's listing and listening. Okay. <laughs> right, James. <laughs> but thank you for being here. We love you being here. Joy Munkin, hello, sweetheart. Talbert's mom. Hi, Talbert. Hi, Talbert's mom. Hi, Talbert. Kalina. Hi, honey. Welcome back in. Thanks for being here, Invisible Bitter, waving hello. Hello, Invisible Bitter. Bobby, hello, Bobby. Thank you for being here, honey. You guys are great. Hi, Jenny. Jenny, I didn't make it to the storage unit, honey, so I don't have, I should probably just send you a picture of what I have, and then you can let me know if you want it. Hey, Ribbit. I don't think I have games tonight either, Jenny. I know I don't have, I have games. some. I have some unopened ones and some opened ones. I have some regular games someplace in this room. <laughs> I need to get down there. Hey, Joyce. Thanks for coming in, sweetheart. Hey, Connie's books Hi, and things. Hi, Connie. Hi, honey. Mookie. Hey, Mookie. Hi, honey. Shell UK. Hello. Thank pretty you for picture, being here. Mookie. Jen Bennett, I got your message, and the answer is ding, 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 ding. Oh. Sold. Thank you, Jen. Thank you so much. Got to love those backdoor deals. You know what else I sold, you guys? I don't know if you guys saw my, um, my Army video, but I sold the two lanterns in the case with the kerosene thing. I guess they were pretty rare. Someone saw the video and I they're sold. So I'm really happy about that. I'm very, very happy about that. Goose. Hey, what are you Chris. doing, Goose? What's going on? Goose, you want to come in? Bluegrass picker. Hey, Anthony. Karen oh. Anderson. Hello. Thank, Thank you. Karen. Woodbine girl. Thank you so much. Hey, Woodbine girl. Ken. Ken. Nice to meet you last night. Very nice to meet you last night, Ken. Hello, Carlton. Hey, Carlton. Hope all is well. Hope all is well is right. Let's see. Casual flipper. 
Just being mm -hmm. casual. As T always says, Junebug. I almost called Junebug tonight. You can count me now. I'm here. I'm here. <laughs> Cricket. Hi, Cricket. Hey, Cricket. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Thank, you. Thank you, Christopher. Okay, here, make sure you guys are using the right link because the other account got closed. That's the new link to the Amazon account. The yeah. other account Somebody who couldn't drop links, all of a sudden she knows how to drop that I one. Went and, I went and saved it before we even went live, so I'd have it handy in case Janine wanted to get it too, because I haven't deleted all the old links off my YouTube pages. I haven't had a chance. So I got to make sure that this new one is, is being used because I want that dollar 27. I don't blame you. I want it too. Dollar 27 is a lot of money. <laughs> Hi, just Jackie. Thanks for coming in. Hi, just Jackie. Yeah. Did you see how quickly I dropped that? Boom. Right into the chat, Deborah. Hi. I'm here. My picture is of my grandson. So cute, Adorable. Deborah. Love it. Shh. Don't say my name. But greetings from my world. My world. Okay, we won't say his name. We will not say his name. Hi, Joe. Good to see you. And Tony Dodge. Hello. Hey, Good Tony. evening. See, look at, I'm already in a better mood being live with everybody, right? It's awesome. Hey, Douglas. Hi, Doug oh, Douglas. Douglas, why do you not have a wrench? Oh, I don't know. I'm not, I'm not on YouTube yet, so I don't know who has a wrench and who doesn't. But um, if anybody... We'll fix that, Douglas. Yeah, we we'll definitely will fix that. Yes. I hope you, I, I hope everyone's doing well, Douglas. Okay, let's see who else is here. Did I say hi to Carlton? Yes. Hi, Carlton. Hi again, Carlton. <laughs> Did I say hi to Andrea? Hi, Andrea, listing and lurking. Hi, Andrea. Andrea, I have a private stock bag tonight. Just saying. Susan Arrington, do you want me to wait until you get back? Um, after you get back from dinner? And who's this? Look who the cat dragged in. Cliff! What is going on with you, sir? Where have Cliff, you where been? Where have you been? He's been Good farming. To see you. It was yeah. farming season. See, now That's it's winter right. up in Canada. So he's going to be online probably more because he won't have to be uh, driving the tractors anymore. It's good to see you, my friend. Welcome back. Welcome in. We're happy that you're here. Thanks for joining us. Boatman, Boatman, hello, 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 Andy. Barb Lee, did I say hi to you? Hi, Barb. Uh, Jules, hey, Jules. And thank you, Jen. I appreciate it so much. Hey, what's up? says KK. Sundays, I don't watch any auctions because it's the day my son visits, but I'm sure glad he goes home before you start. Bad mama here. <laughs> oh, Barbara. I'm so glad that you're here with us. I am very, very glad that you are here with us. Thank you so much. Julie Morris. Hey, Hello. Julie. And there's Bolo Buddies. Courtney. Hi, Bolo Buddies. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Paul Suckling. Hello. Hey, Paul. And Pammy. Pammy just hey. came in. Prayers for Mary Ness. What did I miss? Uh oh, Mary. What happened, Mary? Prayers Mary's for my youngest on. grandson's surgery Monday and Tuesday at the Mayo Clinic. Oh. All right. All right, Mary. Awesome. Prayers, well, I mean, not awesome, but I mean prayers. We're sending prayers. It's going to be good. It's going to all be good. It's always sad when babies have to have um, surgery or any kind of procedure. It's just awful seeing little ones going through that. It's awful for an adult, but it's just doubly as awful for it's a baby. It's going to be good. I feel it. It's going to be real good. Hey, Carol. Thank Carol, you for do you want to register, Carol, honey? I know you've been in a couple of times now. We could drop the registration link just so you registered. It's up to you. 
No Hi, pressure. Pete. Hey, Pete. Three Pete's. Good evening. Thanks for being here. All right, I think you changed this picture too. Either that or I don't see the pictures as well when I go on. Hi, Connie. Um, yeah, goodbye. You put take that down. Another Connie. Donna, take that down. Why? What am I missing? Just ignore it. Trust me. Really? Mm-hmm. Okay. I don't know what I'm missing. Can you text it to me? <laughs> am I being that slow? Yes. I am. People are laughing. Um, is there something I should be doing? Oh, you took care of it? Yep. Was it was it was there a bad picture? No, it's a it's it's a sexual orientation word. Oh. Oh, I didn't know that. Hi, Kelly. Yeah, let's not explain it to her. <laughs> well, I'll talk to you about it in the fuzzy room later, okay? <laughs> oh my gosh, no, I have I have no idea. Oh my gosh. Hey, Michelle P. Courtney, we'll send you the link. I'll have a session behind the green curtain. <laughs> Uh oh, two bucks needs needs an invite too. Susie Q, I'm here. I've been here, and I don't even know what I just walked <laughs> into. So don't feel bad. Don't feel bad at all. Hey, Patties. Hey, Jonathan Alfaro. I, I, someone just texted me the picture and I still don't get it. Hi, Jonathan. It was a troll. It was a troll with the lead. Oh, did they have a wrench? No. No. Okay. All right. Okay. Well, back to... Uh, back to uh, saying hi to everybody. <laughs> back to saying hi to everybody. Hi, hi Jonathan. I don't, I don't know what's going on. I guess I'm just slow when sure. it comes to no, that. No, she really doesn't. It's, it's, the, it's the break in the English and the and, and it's fine. Don't worry. Hi, Lucinda. Hey, How Lucinda. You, honey? Hello, Betty Webb. Nice to meet hey, you. Nice to meet you. Christine, hello. Thank you. Thanks for coming. All right. Now <laughs> Just Jackie, yeah, keep sitting on those hands, please. <laughs> ah. Okay, someone just sent me what it meant. You guys should stop. <laughs> I had no idea that there was actually. Courtney just got it. Uh, gosh almighty. It's okay. Hey, you know what? We'll just, uh, maybe we hit an algorithm and those kind of people are going to be coming in. Who knows? Who knows? Hi, Michelle Trout. What is <laughs> Christine Rose says she figured out how to add a picture. Yay. Did she? Let's see. <laughs> well, she why haven't you added one, Christine? She has a picture. It is a picture. She has a picture. Oh, why of don't we have a picture? Oh, it's a cameo. See how no. it's weird that you can see the picture. And I mean, now I can see it. But the other day, that picture of KK, I did not see today until Look. you put it up here. That's so weird. That's what I see. Yeah, I'll show you what I see. Hi, Valerie. Thanks for coming Valerie in. Valerie Ramish? Yeah. Didn't I say to you I haven't seen Valerie? Yeah, and then she came in. She made a comment on my YouTube page. Oh, remember? She, on my she, Facebook page. In, she made a comment yeah. on your YouTube video, but I haven't seen her. Welcome, Valerie Galmish. I hope you're well. I asked about you the other day. Michelle, I've not forgotten about you. Your stuff, your the stuff that you're interested in ended up down at the mini storage, and I need to go get it. 
Yeah, well, you know what, Scott? Scott and Harlan are another story. That's why they let her. <laughs> oh, Christopher, stop. <laughs> Christopher, stop. Take that down. Take that down. We have Courtney in here. <laughs> Hi, Junk Trader. <laughs> Oh, she shows up in, um, in Scott. And they, they, Scott and they let her stay. I haven't been over to Scott's. <laughs> I haven't, I haven't had time. Oh. Hey, Shelly. Hey, Shelly. <sighs> so is today's is tonight's auction lingerie and naughty oh, stuff. stuff. <laughs> oh, I wish God. I had lingerie and naughty stuff. It sells. Sex sells. That's Connie's cousin. Oh my god. Pat D's. I don't know. What are you watching? It's uh it's a cameo I bought from just Sandy. That's what her um her picture is, but it's for me it's just to see. There's no there's no picture. Okay, well, this is what her picture is. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. And you can't see that. No. Nope. That's <laughs> yes, not what it I is, have. James. True. What, what what do you see up on the screen? You see the cameo? Yeah. No. Yeah. I guess it's my cameo. It's Kathy's cameo? I thought she bought it on Sandy's. She bought it from Kathy? I don't know. I don't know. I thought she just said she bought it from Just Sandy. I don't know, but hi, Carla. Hi, Fancy. Hi, Carla. Oh, no. Kathy says no. Okay. I'm so confused. Okay. All right, you guys. Everyone, thank you so much for coming in. Hey, you know what? I know, I know that we're, we are definitely going to have an auction, but you know what? I was talking to a friend of mine. Um, today, let me just get these banners off. I'm just curious, like across the country, like here in South Florida, the prices of homes have skyrocketed. Like homes are so expensive right now. And the minute they go on the market, they're like sold. Like people are buying and moving and selling their homes like crazy. Is that going on in other parts of the country? Is that going on in like your state? Is that happening well, in, it is in New York? York. Is that happening in Long Island? It's Do you know? In general. Same here. Huh. In Maryland. Um, oh, 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 oh. I see what's, I see what's, uh, I didn't buy it from Kathy. She wanted it, but she was nice enough to let me get it. Oh, that's, that's nice. Um, so Pat D says big time where I am at. Isn't this interesting? Yep, the same in um MD is Maryland. Is yep. that right? Yep. Same here where I live too. In Mississippi, also. Isn't that amazing? Yes, in Seattle. It's mo moving to the suburbs. Let's see what James says. People are moving to Florida from New England and other cities. Yeah, it's crazy, 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 crazy how um how the houses well, are selling. Wants, crazy. It, it depends on where you are, but at least here, nobody wants to pay what we pay in real estate taxes. That's for sure. Um, Marion, I don't know if you um noticed, and I double checked your email, but I sent you an invoice. I was gonna, I was gonna cancel it tomorrow morning. Um, if you still wanted um what you ordered, but you should have an invoice sitting in your inbox, honey. Um, it's up to you. If you don't want it, just let me know, and I'll cancel your order. Um, Shannon, same in Missouri. No, Missouri's M O. Michigan. Michigan. Same in Michigan. Same in New Hampshire. Huh. Oh, Marion, you paid. Okay, awesome. Okay, I haven't checked my PayPal. So cool. I'm in California and I'm not moving, Perlini says. Has, houses are selling faster than toilet paper before a hurricane here. Isn't it amazing? Right? The last year the house in Arizona was appreciated at almost 182000 
it it has appreciated by that much. Vintage memories, bulk construction supplies are limited. Still trying to catch up from China, not doing my manufacturing for months. So new home construction is very slow. I'm in Indiana and houses are selling quickly for inflated prices. But once you sell, there's nothing available. That's the problem, right? That's the problem. There's people are like... Like, what do you do? Like, yeah, you cash in on the home that you have, but like, where do you move to, to, even if you wanted to take like a well, lateral move? My girlfriend here on Long Island, she sold her house. She wasn't expecting to sell it this quickly or to even do it, but she just got an offer she couldn't refuse. I mean, she has a beautiful home. She's the superintendent of BOCES for Suffolk County. So she has a fabulous job and her husband is a tenured school teacher. But they sold their house in Sayville and they want to go to Great River and they're going to end up renting now because they have to be out in a week because they can't find anything. Wow. Cliff says house prices have tanked here, down 25% from last year. And he's in Canada, you guys. So that's interesting. I wonder why um, ours appreciated 200000 Andrea. Yeah, but the problem is, is like, where do you go, right? On Today World News, it showed a wedding in New York with 7,000 people attending. The governor was very upset. It took like it was in some... Who has a wedding with 7,000 people? Was it a celebrity? I have no idea. 7,000 people? I have no idea. It has to have been a celebrity. You can't even afford, you can't even afford, oh my God. I mean, I can't even tell you what weddings even cost here. They're like three fifty dollars a plate these days here in New York. What's that? Weddings. Oh my God, isn't that crazy? And then let's see, Suzy Q, interest rates are low, which increases the demand. Yeah. Oh my God, the gifts that they got. They probably didn't need them. If they could afford to have 7,000 people at their wedding, they don't need the wedding gifts. They must have been dignitaries or something. They had to be. I mean, the average upscale wedding usually is like four or 500 people at the most here. I mean, we pushed 250 and believe me, we, we scrimped, saved, battled between his parents, my parents and... We did, we, we did like cheap on a, you know, years ago, I think it was, what was it? A, a Saturday day wedding because Friday nights were becoming popular. Like we did like a Saturday day wedding. So we didn't pay the normal, like 150 a plate. We probably paid 75 and we took an off. We took July 29th. It was hot, really hot, like sweaty hot, not June. Like everybody gets married. We right, lucked out. Right. Because New York, you can't weddings here. I'm telling you that right now they're like three to three fifty a plate. <clears throat> oh, it was actually Cuomo's cousin's wedding. Hmm. Hi, Matt. Thanks for coming in, honey. Interesting. Thanks for joining us. Do as I say, not as I do. That's my dilemma. I think I can sell my house for great profit, but if I sell it, I have to plan for the next step. Yeah, and. Even to be able to make a lateral move is almost impossible because there's nothing on the market. Nothing, nothing on the market. Yeah, and then rental. I don't know about different parts of the country, but rentals here, oh my gosh. Rentals are crazy. Rentals are absolutely crazy. And I don't know how people can pay the money that they pay for rent. Like, it's just crazy. Like, why not buy? But some people just like to rent, I guess. Yep. Rent is absolutely crazy. What does Talbert's mom say? There were 7,000 people out on the streets rioting. For the love of God, let them have a peaceful gathering of ce celebration. It was Oprah and Gail King getting married. I don't know. I get a kick out of out of all the lockdowns in states and then you see their governors at dinners in crowds with no masks set, set an example if you want people to follow it exactly right we're selling renting for six months to build oh are you andrea awesome 
That's great. That is awesome. I'd love to build, but there's no way like in my, the way my life is that we could even like, um, life is just too crazy. Hi, Cindy Rosen. Does anybody know how the houses are selling in Delaware right now? I have a house there we are selling. Does anybody know how the houses are selling in Delaware? That's where we originally, we were going to go, but we, we opted out. Loot Raider, I flip houses. I live in them and work on them while I'm here. When the market says sell it, I sell it. I just got this house in August and it's already gone up, already gone up without work done yet. Good for you. That's that's awesome. what happened to our house that we're in now when we bought this house. Within one year it appreciated eighty five thousand and we didn't put a dime into it. That's awesome. Hi, Connie Johnson. Thanks for coming in, sweetheart. Hey, wow, 132 are you here tonight. Thank you, everyone. Nice. Thanks for coming in. You guys are awesome. Kimmy, hello, sweetheart. Hi, Kimberly. I checked my PayPal, forgot to push the pay button, but I did. It should be okay. Marion, <laughs> I've done that. So I get it. But but I just I, I haven't checked my PayPal. Well, yesterday I sent out some invoices quick, but um, I haven't checked. So <laughs> Susanna, hello, honey. Hi, Susanna. Thank you for coming in. Yeah, so funny. Okay, Kimmy, I'm sorry I didn't call you today. My my day ran away from me again. I'm gonna try to give you a call tomorrow, or you call me in the afternoon when you're done with your your morning chores. Hello, Lara. Thank you hey, for Laura. coming in. Good to see you. Thanks. Thank you so much. All right. Yeah, Kimmy, did you see who's here? Cliff. Cliff, we miss you. Thanks for coming in. I hope all is well with you and yours. Hatties. Hatties, can I move in with you? Garage bunk beds, right? <laughs> uh, I can talk to my husband about it. No guarantees what he's going to say, though, Hatties. <laughs> Why is D. Scott saying, wow? What are they reading? I move every year or so, so my stuff stays in tubs. Haha, <laughs> but it's how I'm paying off my blasted student loans. Seeing the before and after is fun too, right? You're smart. You're a smart cookie. That's awesome. I know student loans, man. I'll tell you what, I am so grateful my daughter got a scholarship because... Those student loans, I know people that are in their late 30s and early 40s that are still paying off their their uh, student loans. Sandy has a room for rent for $1,000 if anybody's interested. Sandy does? Just be aware that she lags. <laughs> yeah. I know, right? So... So a friend of mine, Paul, just texted me. He's watching in the background. I would totally, and he suggested buying a motor coach instead of renting for six months. Oh, I'd be 100% into one, too. Oh, I would, too. The problem is, is parking it, though, and emptying it and charging it. And, you well, know, the problem is you're gonna live in it. and having it because you would have to pull like some kind of U-Haul behind you with all your inventory. <laughs> right. You no, know, I could never do it. Not I could never do what we do and do that. But, right. you know, I've always dreamed of, you know, getting a coach and going cross country. Are you kidding me? That would be so awesome. Does that mean you can lag to rent? I don't know. Lag on the rent. Lag on the rent. You can park for free in most Walmart parking lots. You can. Yeah. You yeah, can't park can. in there, can you? You can tra uh, tractor trailers and um, and uh, like motor coaches can park for free there. But the only thing is, is you still have to be able to go someplace and there's batteries that need to be charged. There's right. There's tanks that need to be flushed. And they don't have that kind of hookup. No, right? no. And there's tanks that need to be filled. And, you Mama know, you G. have to go. Hi, honey. Who's that? Mama G. Mama G. Hey, Mama G. Mama G's in the house, you guys. Mama G. <laughs> 
That's so funny. All right. Awesome. So, um, T. Donna. What you got, honey? What do you got, Donna? <laughs> um, I'm actually going to bring my last two pieces of lavender tonight. Oh. Never. I kept a whole bunch of those to list. List? Hey, <laughs> Never listed one. I sold every single one of them at auction. So I'm going to do them individually in case somebody wants to buy a beautiful piece of lavender as a Christmas present for someone. All so right. I have I'll, I'll first, sale, first lot of the night, lavender. Oh, I'm going first. <laughs> I went first this afternoon. Okay, wait, over there. I have to go get it. All right. Okay. I'll go get it. Oh my gosh, I have so much inventory around me that needs to go out. No one call me tomorrow. You just told Kimmy to call you. In the afternoon. All right, here we go. Very first item of the night. It's a brand new piece of Levenger. Um, it's a briefcase. But it's for no, are you on lot nine? Oh, you know what? Everybody take a moment and refresh. And as soon as you refresh, I won't show it, I won't show anything. We'll just chat for a few seconds. Hit refresh. So what everybody on, on um Janine. So hey Robin, Robin's in the house, you hey, guys. Robin. Hello, Robin. Um Everybody refresh. Everybody go to live chat. I'll give everybody a minute to do that. Um, oh, Tammy says, Donna, my daughter's birthday is tomorrow. She's getting a Levenger desk. Oh, is she, Tammy? Oh, she bought that beautiful Levenger from me. So pretty. That's what I thought, Janine. Thank you. Hi, Tammy. Thanks for coming in. That's what I thought. I did have it written down right, but yeah, I just wanted to make sure. For me, it's 10. Thank you, Janine. Donna's on 10, she said. Yeah, I'm on 10. Um, okay, refreshed and ready to go. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. She's going to love it. Oh, I'm so happy Tammy bought a beautiful desk for me, you guys. Levenger desk. Okay, and one more thing. There's 131 of you here. If there's anybody that's in the background that wants to register, can you drop the registration link? Uh -huh. yeah. I suggest that you register now. Make yourself known. It doesn't cost anything. We do take registrations so that we do have your information for invoicing because we don't require immediate payment. We invoice. Um, sometimes it can be a day or two or three or four, but you will get an invoice. In some cases, it's a week. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> but um, well, we we're also invoice. holding on. We're also just tell them, you know, we're kind of revamping the shipping days and the and the shipping amount, uh, the purchase amount. So. Yes. So we are going to be shipping twice a week. Um, I haven't decided the days yet. I think Monday is definitely for you, for me and for you too. And then the other day, I'm not sure because I can't do shipping every day anymore. And then um, we're also holding the merchandise until it reaches $30. Um, we do provide free shipping, but we're not going to ship out things that like are $15 and then it's going to cost us $8 to ship out. It just doesn't make sense for us. Um, we did it for a long time, but we're, um, we're changing that. So it has to be a $30 and we'll, we'll hold your order until it gets to $30 and then we will invoice you and ship out your merchandise. Okay. So here it is. It's brand new. Um, I guess it's for a laptop, right? No, Cindy, we do need you to register, please. We, we don't, we don't allow that. I'm sorry. We do need you to register. <coughs> excuse me and there's that and here is where your power cord so they have no way to invoice you if you're not registered oh thank you jules yeah yep so if you um please take the moment to it's a quick it's a quick form it takes two seconds to fill out um and then it has the zipper 
and I'm going to start this off at $35. It's got the pocket. It's brand new. It's never been used. Brown Levenger. And there it is right there. Oops, it's upside down. Yeah, and so these no cost to register. You just need to fill the form out. That's all. And for those of you that don't know, Lavender is a really beautiful, much sought after company. Susan Arrington is a three in front of that five, I hope. Beautiful leather products. Seventeen inch. Um, let me get. I saw Chessie running off with my tape measure earlier. Uh oh. I'm going to have the same problem you have. Wait a minute. Yeah, and I forgot to look for my tape measure. There was one here. There was a small one I had. Christopher oh, Chatworth's in for 40. Oh, thank you, Christopher. Let me see if I have one out here. Hold on one second. Forty-two from Deborah Reed. <clears throat> She's a good girl. She put it back where, where I had it. Christopher okay. in for 44 now. All right. Let's see. This would fit a... 46 from Sandy. Uh, it measures 14 inches across. Just at 14. So I don't know what size laptop that would be. Sandy's out. Christopher's at 50. It's very handsome. No, Christine. Mm -mm. Deborah Reed is out. Beautiful. Joanne Young is out. We're going to call it to Christopher at 50. All right, Christopher. Andrea got one. Yes, she bought one like this. You use it, Andrea? Going once now. All right, we're sold. Sold, sold, sold to Mr. Christopher. All right, and the next piece of Levenger that I have is for a iPad. It's for an iPad. And it has a little pocket here on the side and has a little pocket here. Uh, it has a spot for a pen. So I guess you could put a tablet here for writing if you wanted to. Um, it doesn't have any other features. It's, it's pretty simple. Um, it is a Levenger. And I'm going to start this one off at... Um, we have KK starting us off at 40. Oh, uh, thank you, KK. Pretty brown. Actually, that's not true. Deborah Reed started us off at 25. KK went to 40. Oh, thanks, KK. It's really yeah. pretty. Ready. Levenger for iPad. Forty-two from Deborah, forty-five now from Kathy. It's called a pad folio. Is that what it's called? Cliff. A pad pad portfolio. That's awesome. Um, right. What size is it? I have a Pro Max 12 inch. Open it again, Susan asked. I have a Pro Max 12 inch. Um, and this one is made for I'll tell you what size. 
Oops, wrong side. 47 now from Deborah Reed. It's all right, I'm used to it. 50 now from KK. It's for a um, nine inch, no more than nine and a half inch iPad. Which I don't know if iPads come different sizes, do they? No. Do they? Maybe? I don't even know. I have tablets, not iPads, you know, like Galaxy, Samsung, things like that. I don't deal in Apple products. Okay. Yes, they come in different sizes, iPads. Nine and a half inches across. Yes, mine is a 10 inch, Susan Arrington says. Well, 10 might be tight in there. Yeah. No, this is too big for a mini. I've seen the minis, right? The minis are small. Oh, she's saying the screen is measured diagonally. I should know that. That's how they measure TVs. Oh, should I have measured this? Thank diagonally? you, Cindy. Thank you, honey. Should should I? Have yeah, that's how the measurement goes. She's right. That's how, like, when you talk about like a fifty-five inch TV, you measure it from diagonally from corner to corner. Um, Robin, I said hi when you came in. I don't know if you heard me, honey. Have you made it to your next destination? Maybe for a nook? I don't know. Okay, so if I were to measure from corner to corner, it's 12 inches. Okay, so anything less than 12 inches would fit in there. Okay. So 12 inches would fit. So an iPad's 10, they're saying? So yes, it would fit in here. It's All probably right. made we're sold to Kathy for 50. It's probably made for a 10 inch. Thank you, Kathy. All right. And you can go ahead and wrench Cindy Pierce. She's all registered and welcome to the family, Cindy. Oh, uh, welcome, Cindy. Thank you so much. So very nice to meet you. Everybody, welcome, Cindy. Okay. Levenger is going to KK and she paid 50. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Thank you, KK. All right, this is going to be my lot number 11. And I'm going to bring back these eagles that I showed earlier, but I was waiting to see who it was that has that eagle in their, um, in their profile picture to see if they would be interested in this. But there was some interest from other people. So, okay, so this one is the American Eagle Gallery Fine Porcelain... Um, and I think he's awesome and he does not have any nicks or dings or anything. He's absolutely beautiful. Look at that. Wow. He's great. I know. Right. Isn't he beautiful? So, um, there's, there's three Eagles. Um, I didn't get them all at the same place. These actually came from an estate. Um, I don't see any dings or nicks on these, um, they have stickers on the bottom with a whole bunch of numbers. And I did peel back one of the stickers to see if there was anything, but that's all that's on there. So I don't know, I'm gonna show them to you in a minute. Let me peel back this one. Oh, it says made in China. That's all it says, just made in China. So here's, what they are so there's this eagle i just grouped them together because i had that awesome one so i put these together with it but they came from two different places and then there's this one so these are made in china and this one says on it yeah they are beautiful aren't they sandy this one says 1985 M-A-R-U-R-I-U-S-A. Anybody know what that is? If anybody knows what that is, I'll show you an up close of it. Oh, they're sold, Perlini. They're banks. They'll be going out tomorrow, honey. I sold those yesterday. Um, That's what it says on it. 
Okay, so the three eagles will go together as one um, one package, and I'm going to start these off at $15. $15 for the three eagles. These two in flight. That's one and two. All right, Deborah Reed is coming in first at 15. Paul Suckling's going to do 20. And this one is just amazing. Let's take a close up look at this with the Donna Loop. Oh, and if anybody's interested in buying a Donna Loop, please <laughs> feel free to click on the link. <laughs> Donna may well earn a small commission, but it's no cost to you. Yeah, it's no cost to you, but I will earn a small commission. <laughs> Paul comes in at 20. Deborah Reed now at 22. June bug at 24, Paul Suckling now at 26, June bug at 28. Awesome, right, you guys? Oh, Cindy, you need to refresh, honey. Oh, Cindy, refresh. Refresh. We'll give you a minute to refresh. Someone please. And look at what the drag what the cat dragged in. Wow, Robert. Hello, Robert, honey. Where have you been? Oh my goodness gracious. Welcome back. Hi, honey. Hello. Good to see you. Good to see you. And how come you didn't come in with your typical, hello, my peeps? He did. He said it afterwards. <laughs> oh, he did? Well, what's yeah. up, my peeps? <laughs> what's up, my peeps? Yeah, it's uh, really, really beautiful. We'll give, who was it that's, that was lagging? Cindy Pierce. Cindy Pierce. We'll give her just a minute, you guys, because. Um, All right. Well, she came in with 30 right after Paul came in at 30. So she's catching up a little bit, but she's not quite there. Now we have Paul Suckling in at 34 after Junebug came in at 32. Good to see you, Robert. Guys, if you're not subscribed to Zombie Bargain Hunter, great channel to be following. All right, Cindy Pierce is caught up and she's now in at 38. Junebug is out. Paul Suckling is out. Hey, Lego man. What's up, Brandon? Hi, Brandon. Welcome in, honey. Susan Arrington now at 40. Deborah Reed is out. Something about eagles, man. I love them. I mean, these are the the these other ones. I mean, they're these are nice, but this one here is yeah, it's just the perfect bald eagle head. Like, oh my gosh, this one's beautiful, and even like the feathers and the whole thing is just amazing. Casual flippers got an eagle. Nice. Demanding. Who's demanding? I'm not demanding. Susan Arrington's at 40. Thank you, Mama G. Thank you, Janine. Thanks, guys. Thank you so much. Tell me the head's not from China. Tell me the head's not from China. Um, these, this one here had a China sticker on it. But this one... No, I have not, Lisa. This one does not have... We, we, we saw an awesome one when we went to Alaska. I don't know where this one is made. You'd, you would have to look up... You'd have to look up the company and see where they make their stuff. I have no idea where the American Eagle Gallery... It's... Uh, I'm with you, Fancy Nancy. M-A-R-U-R-I, -A -A USA. So maybe it's made in the USA. I don't know. Okay, are we sold? Going once to Susan Arrington. Going twice. And we're sold to Susan for $40. Congratulations, Susan. $40 to Susan for the Eagles. It's so good, right? All right, sweetheart, you're up. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. Nice start. You ready, T? Yep. 
Thank you, everyone. Aww. Find her. So sweet. Same spot. Ooh, look at you, fancy with the with the. I'm trying. I'm with trying. With the downward camera. I'm trying. I don't know how it's gonna work, but I'm trying. Don't look at my storage unit now. <laughs> All right. Looks to be just shy of eight inches with the clasp. It is um, nine two five with what looks to be a gold overlay, cubic zirconia CZ. I don't know if you guys can see. I don't have a loop like Donna, but I'll try my magnifying glass, which I meant to grab to show you guys the close-up of the... There was a... It's signed as well. And, of course, now I find 14 measuring tapes and no magnifying glass this is the story of t's life <laughs> my husband's downstairs um giggling giggling i'm sure because t is the most disorganized sometimes especially when it comes to this and I cannot find my loop. My loop, not Donna's. And I am gonna order Donna's because I think it's awesome. But I don't know. We're starting this at 50, meanwhile, just FYI. I, um, I'm still looking, I promise. Let me give you a weight on this as well. Do that while I still try to decide where my loop is. 18 grams. 18 grams. And I'll see if I can put this up. Maybe it'll work. Oh, this will work. I could do it this way. Please do not look at my storage unit hands. We need Goose to be showing that piece. I know, right? <laughs> Please don't look at my storage unit hands. And then the other side, where did I see? There was, there was, um, oh no, it's on the other side of this clasp. Let's see if I can focus in. I'm bad, but this is my first time trying it like this. So bear with me for one minute. Damn, darn it, darn it, <laughs> darn it, darn it, darn it. T, just lay it out. We see that it's says nine two five. No, but just there's a more, there's a signature. There's 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 two other letters here. I want to see if I can hone in on. Oh, you can't see it with um, no. your magnifying glass? I can't find my magnifying glass. I found more measuring tapes, though. <laughs> now I'm inundated with measuring tapes. <laughs> your magnifying glass? Oops, sorry. I was popping out my, um, my chat because I closed it by accident. All right. I guess it's not going to happen. Sorry, guys. Something you, I don't know. Something you, I don't know. I can't read it. It's actually, I had had it on the wrong side. It's actually on the back side of the clasp Something here. You. So there it is. This is how it clasps in here and closes. All right. You guys go over and give the, the video a thumbs up, please. It helps so much. Hi, Devin. Thanks for coming in. All 
All right, there we go. No interest. Yeah, there's interest. KK, oh, okay. I don't know, I can't see the chat doing it this way. I can't see the chat. <laughs> oh, yeah. KK came in at 50. I'm sorry. No, that's right. I just, because I had to put my camera down like this, I can't yeah, see. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> okay. Nope. KK's at 50. $50. Thank you, Kathy. Right. <laughs> yes, Laura, I know. What's Laura saying? No, no. She said, I think it's funny when people give thumbs down. Well, I just had seven thumbs down. Now I have sex. So I don't know. Somebody changed their mind and went and gave a thumb or took the thumbs down away. I guess. No. I don't know. They were having a guilty conscience. So why would they possibly do that? All right. Let's call to Kathy if there's no other interest. Kathy's going to steal this tonight. All right. We're going to go once to Kathy. Thank you guys for the thumbs up. I see it growing. Kelly says it's beautiful. Hello, Miss Autumn Grace. Hello, Miss Martha. Hey, Miss Martha. Cheers, 710 Oil. Hello. Hey, 710. Going twice to KK. That was me only kidding. Was it Sandy? Oh, now it's back to seven. <laughs> sold, sold, sold to Kathy's Corner for $50. All right. Thank you, Kathy. Thank you, KK. All right. So since I still have my um, thing bent down like this, let's see if there's any interest here. Guys, I cannot find a marking on these. I honestly cannot find a marking on these. They are very pretty. They are really pretty, but I don't know what they are. I don't have a tester. I mean, they're gold tone. That's what we're going to leave it at as they, they are gold tone. Um, I have no idea. I don't see a marking. This actually is from my own personal collection. They were a gift at some point in my life. Um, but this is what they look like. Let's just start it out at 10. All right. Lot number eight to KK. Thank you, KK. Um, to be honest with you, I think it's all right. I'm, I think it's six. Let me see. We'll do a test. Okay. We'll do a test in a minute. I have two here and we'll see which one, um, is stronger. So we'll do a test in a second. Okay. So we have Deborah Reed in at 10. We have Tammy in at 10. T step away from the table. Tammy's in at 15. What do you mean step away from the table? Okay, you're fine now. <laughs> the table was bouncing. Oh, I was just writing because I forgot to write Kathy down on the uh, Deborah Reed comes in at 17. We were all bouncing up and down. That's why I said step Sorry. away from the table. <laughs> okay. Tammy's in at 20. $20 is where we're at right now. We're looking for $22. Ooh, that looks like a bad burn on it your... Is, no, you know what? It's storage unit. I, I, I caught it when I was there. Yeah, I, I the Band-Aid keeps coming off because it's in a really bad spot. I, I caught it going into the storage unit, you know, the sharp edges on the doors. Yeah cut it yesterday or the other day you had to see me i i had no 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 napkin paper towel or anything on me i had to use the inside of my mask to hold it on there till i ran to the ladies room and <laughs> washed oh it oh my gosh laura wants to know uh, the post or the backs gold i don't know how to ch how do i check that just the color of it the color of it oh oh oh, oh the color all right well i'll take the back, the backs, this back looks silver, to be honest with you. The backings themselves look silver. Yeah, the posts are silver too. Is the lighting not good here? Is this not good lighting? No, it's Should good. I have stronger lighting here. No, no, it's good. It's good. We can see real well. Okay. Okay, so we've got Tammy at 20. Is anybody else? 
Um, want to come in at 22, 22 to Deborah Reed. Thank you guys. Appreciate it. There's a lag. Um, the lag, the lag might be just from you. We will, um, why don't you take a moment and refresh? All right. Tim, I am going, oh. I'm going to, I'm going to up the ante on the slot. Okay. okay. Whoever wins this slot is going to, I, I almost a hundred percent positive. What I'm going to show you now is gold. I'm almost a hundred percent positive, but it's, it's, it's not heavy. It's like 3.3, .3, but it's missing a post. It's missing a post. One of them has a post. One of them doesn't. 3.3 ounces on that. But maybe you guys um, fix jewelry or you can um, get a post for it or... Maybe it's worth your while to scrap it. I have no idea what even scrap gold these days is going for. I probably should be scrapping it, but I don't have time. I, I have something at the jewelry store for three months now. I'll be lucky if it's there when I go back. Okay, Kathy's Corner's in at 37. We had Tammy came in at 35. Deborah Reed is lagging a little bit, but now she's out. Kathy's Corner's at 37. $37 for KK. Tammy's in at 45. Thank you, Tammy. Thank you, Kathy. Kathy's out. We're going to call it to Tammy for $45. We're going to go once. We're going to go twice and jewelry, etc. Did she come in? She came in at, yes, 47. And then Tammy came in at 50. And Laura's coming back in at 52. Oh, remind Laura. It's and Casual Flipper is reminding everyone that they're $5 increments after 50. So, Laura, if you would like to come in at 55, honey, that would be the next bid. Thank you, Robert. For my jewelry people, too, since it looks like that's who's bidding, I'm throwing this in as well. Laura, as that's okay, can, honey. 55 from Laura. As you can see, it is broken. It is broken, but I'm throwing it in. I think this might be gold as well. I have no idea. It, it's I was going to take some of this stuff to scrap it, but guys have fun with it. All right. We've got Laura at 55 and Robert, thank you so much. Yeah. I basically go, I, I either upload a video or go live almost every day, honey. And we do, we've, we've got a great family of friends here. That we've grown like crazy with all kinds of new people. Can you give us a weight on that? Yep. Yeah. And um, Brandon, we are we're uh, she's a hundred percent sure that the large hoops are gold. She's not a hundred percent sure on the small hoops, and she's not a hundred percent sure on the chain. She was taking all this 1. stuff. 8, 1. 1.8 on the pieces of the chain, and again, I say pieces because here's the clasp end, and for what weight all together, too. I did 1.8 total. No, 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 earrings and all. Oh, everything? Okay. Yeah, weigh everything all together. Um, she was taking this stuff to the jewelers to have it tested to see if it was gold. She 11 grams. It's gold, so it's like buying a lottery ticket. She's 11 not 100%. Grams. 11 grams. So the we've got Tammy at 65. You're at 11 grams for everything? Yeah. T? Yes. 11 grams. Hi, Denali. We've got... Oh, that's weird. Hi, Denali. Hi, Denali. So that's good luck. We've got Laura in at 70. We've got Brandon came in at 75. Thank you, Brandon. 
I was just looking to see if I could see any marking for sure on that. No, the little ones are not gold. Did you say the little ones were not gold? They weren't. I don't think they are. I don't okay, think sorry. Okay. I don't think they are, no. I, I, don't, again, I, I, I all, when we hung up, when we hung up, when we said goodbye before, I tried to check every little nook and cranny of these earrings. The only thing I can say with these earrings is they were a gift to me from a mom, an aunt, somebody. So I know they're good. If they're costume, they're good costume. because It's bijuteria. Bijuteria. <laughs> so maybe weigh them without the little ones is what um, Courtney is saying. All right. That's not accurate, Tammy's saying. Okay, I, I, I'm i sorry. I thought you were saying that I'm you thought that the small ones were gold. No, so I, don't, my mistake. I don't think they small ones are. I have, again, I'm not 100% on any of it, but I kind of know a little bit. And um, uh, 5.2 on the, the necklace and the earrings. The necklace and the earrings is 5.2. Yeah, the chain definitely looks like gold. Yeah. They they actually, the right that I look at it, there actually is a mark on the clasp. Let's see if I can see what that the clasp says. So now that we've um okay, so Tammy's in at 85. Price of gold has gone up, hasn't it? I have no idea. Oh, Again. do you have a magnet, Susie Q says? I do. All it's right. with it's Let's with my magnifying glass. <laughs> Let's try the magnet test. Lego man is out. Hey, Punisher. Welcome in. If it's gold over sil silver, that test would still pass. Do you mean the magnet test, Lara? That's non-conclusive. Metal, brass, etc., aren't are not magnetic. Magnet test can eliminate, not guarantee. Yes, silver doesn't usually stick. Gold never does. Going twice to Tammy for eighty-five dollars. If you want to not call it until I get the magnet, I found in my basket of jewelry supplies, including, including my. Oh, I guess the battery died on this. I wonder if I left it on. Well, I must have left it on. Hi, Donna Quigley. Welcome in, honey. Thanks for joining us this evening. The earrings are not magnetic. The The necklace is. Oh, the necklace is? The earring and these and earrings. those are, okay. And the necklace is? The, 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 these are not... But these, the necklaces. Yeah. You guys can retract. I'm good with that. Hi, Perlene. Or, or I'll tell you what, I'll add a piece of gold that I know for sure. It's, it's a cross. It's, um, I'll give you a weight on this. It is. Two point six, two point six grams on that. It is definitely gold on that, and it is not. It does not. It's not get picked up by the magnet. Two point six on that. Okay, so let's do this. Let's do the earrings and the cross are definitely gold. We'll put that on one side, and then the other two pieces are just bonus pieces. They're not gold. Um, do you want to give a weight on the earrings and the cross? No. Yep. Six grams. Six grams. Okay, so you guys are bidding on six grams of gold. Let's start from the beginning. 
plus these two beautiful earrings and then the necklace is just just a bonus it's just yeah it's probably just plated so that's so where do you, what do you want to start the bidding on for the two earrings the let earrings somebody, let somebody toss something out there okay so you've got the the bijoteria earrings the gold earrings and the gold cross And somebody started off. Somebody put a bid in. Is it 10 or 14 carat? Do you know? How do I tell? Does the, does the cross say on in, in the back of it if it's 14 carat? No. No, I just know where. We're... Are you kidding? Start from the beginning? Question mark. Um, Tammy, what do you want to, how do you want to handle it? Oh, Tammy's at 85. Oh, I thought you retracted. I thought you said you wanted to retract, Tammy. Tammy's at 85 for the earrings and the, the cross. Is that right? Am I am I re reading this right, Mama G? Because I thought I saw retracted. Out to Tammy. Uh, Laura says out to Tammy. Tammy, you're in at 85, honey. That was before she put the cross in. She retracted and then T threw in the cross. Yes, she's in at 85. Ding, 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 ding. Everybody else is out. We've got Tammy at 85. We're going to sell it. We're going to sell it. As Chris the Goose says, sell it. Going once. Thank you, Tammy. Thank Thanks, you, Tammy. Thank you so much, Tammy. Thank you, guys. See, I'm just learning, guys. Please bear Going with me. twice. And with a fair warning to everyone, and thank you, everyone, for your patience and for bidding. We are sold, 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 sold to Tammy. I'm going to the corner. I'll see you later. This is exhausting. <laughs> I'm tired. Are you kidding me? Your job is hard, T. Who's tired? <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? I am not made for that. I'm not made for it. <laughs> You're still up. I'm going to go fix myself a little drink. We're getting drinks now? What's that? We're getting drinks now? <laughs> I'm getting. I'm going to go get a little drink. Okay. Thank you, Tammy. <laughs> you guys take a moment to refresh. That was cuckoo crazy nuts. Thank My camera now is completely all over the place. I have so much stuff behind me. I'm in such a mess here. It's not even funny. Me I, too. You just can't I, see it. I have jewelry. I, I, I have, have jewelry bags, but for now I'm going to put it in this little bubble. And Tammy, I'm throwing in something. I'm going to throw two other little pieces in here. This is just a little, it's just a little something and a little secret something in there for you. Thank you. Thank you for your support. I appreciate it. Um, all right, Tammy, how much was that for Tammy? 85? Is that what we had? You <laughs> Get you one too. Get me one too. <laughs> all right. Um, just for the little inconvenience too, I apologize again. We'll just play our math game with that. All right. Um, <clears throat> KK gets this one. Thank you, Kathy. And oops, let's see. I, don't, I had jewelry bags here. I'll put it in this little thing, actually. And then KK, I'll have a little zippered pouch for your bracelet that that's going to go in. Um, and that's going to go in there. All right, let's see. The, there's only one bracelet I'm going to hold on to unless I get an awesome offer for, but I'm going to hold on to that till later. <laughs> Actually, there's two of them <laughs> because, and, and mom, mom's jewelry is going to be coming up for Black Friday and thereafter because um, we're going to go through all that over the next couple of days and bring you guys stuff that my sister-in-law and my niece are not interested in or just 
they're not our cup of tea, so to speak, I guess. I, I'm not going to keep a lot. I don't wear a lot of jewelry. All right, we're going to switch the jewelry up. But thank you guys for reminding me about the magnet because I know there was a couple of you here, and I thank you guys all so much because people along the way have sent me things for jewelry, and I, I so appreciate it. Um, between the magnet that I just found and the lighted magnifying glass, which I must have left it on because for some reason the batteries must be dead. I can't light it up. I have to fix that. Um, and, of course, the jewelry boards, right? The jewelry boards. So thank you guys for those of you who have sent me that stuff. Um, let's see if there's any interest in this. I kind of pulled a Donna tonight with a makeup jar on shelf pulls. Um, there's also brushes in here, cosmetic brushes, and there is eyeshadow, eyeliner, and um, is the is the is the um, glare too much? Is the glare too much with the jar? It's blush brushes and eyeshadows. Um, this is going to be lot number 10, Mama G, lot number 10. Kathy was eight. Uh, Tammy was nine. So this is 10. Lot number 10. Let's just start it off at 10. Uh, brands in here. I see CoverGirl, Estee Lauder, um, Revlon. I see Rimmel. And I don't know what the brushes are. I don't know if, or the or the eye pencils. Like this is just like an unsharpened eye pencil. Unsharpened eye pencil. Uh, ebony. Maybe that's the color. Yeah, they're not they're not sharpened, but you can see that they're a little like there's rough on the thing there. Um, and there are some brushes in here. There's, let's see, that says Sumita, Sumita. There looks like there's a brush comb thingy in there. Twenty from Kimmy now. <clears throat> Good night, Sergeant Spork. Good night, honey. I'm assuming that's why you're saying be well. Sherilyn's in at twenty-two. Invisible bidder is out. Thank you for bidding. Kimmy's out. We're going to call to Cheryl Lynn. All right, let's go once to Cheryl Lynn at 22. Oh, Mama G's at 25. <laughs> okay, I'm back. Okay, I'm here. All right, we're going to sell to Mama G then. We're going to go once. Going twice now. 
him with a fair warning. Last and final call. Sold to Mama G. Congratulations. Congrats, congrats, congrats. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Mama G. Do you want to go, Donna? Mm, you done? I mean, I, I, I'm never done. I can still pull things. <laughs> okay, I'll go. You regret. Oh, Mama G, you're the best. All right, we're giving that to Kimmy. Send to Kimberly. Awesome. Thank you, Mama G. Thank you, Mama G. Kimberly's crying. Oh. I, I was mm. gonna say I was a little surprised at that. I was like, wow, I I know. I'm like, I don't think I've ever seen Mama G wear makeup. Right. I'm like, boy, she's like me, kind of plain Janie. You know, we just Okay. My mother is still turning around in her grave that I even have lipstick on because for 50 years she told me to put lipstick on. All right, it guys. I've got Donna to wear lipstick to told me to put lipstick on. <laughs> right. I have I to think, credit Donna. And for I that. stopped wearing red. I'm all out of red. That's why I've stopped wearing it. I know. And I have a ton of makeup. Go get yourself some red lipstick, Donna. I know. I know. I know. I will. One of these days. I'll, I'll stop and yelling at us. She wears makeup. <laughs> okay. I've got two kilo balls. This is how big it is. These are filled with vintage Girl Scout uniforms, pants, skirts, sweaters, socks, ties, sashes. I sold these and the person that bid on them never paid for them and has never come back into the chat. So I am going to offer these up. There's two balls for what um, because I had them all ready to ship out and it was a fairly new customer, right T? I can't even remember who it was to be honest mm -hmm. with you. I think you told me once, but I don't remember. Fairly new customer. So I didn't ship them out. You know, some of, some of you guys, I ship out your stuff before you even pay for it, but I didn't ship them out. Anyways, I'm gonna... Santa wants the Girl Scout cookies with them. <laughs> <laughs> right. Um, I'm going to start these off at um, what it's going to cost me to ship these out because I don't want to unpack them and have to reshow them because it's a lot of work to pack. Do you um, want it? You said you have two of them. Do you want to do them each or do you want to? Do you want to start them off each or you want to sell one and then sell the other one? Yeah. So they're, I split them up into two even bundles. Um, so I'm going to start them off with what they're going to cost me to ship out $10. All right. They're vintage Girl Scout uniform, sashes, pants, any so brownie mystery, stuff in here. It's a mystery ball. Girl Scout and Brownies or just Girl Scout? What do they weigh? Um, I'll tell you what they weigh. Hold on a second. I'll give you a weight on them. This one weighs 13, 10 ounces. 13 pounds, 10 ounces on this ball. All right. Again, guys, we're, we're, we're doing one at a time. So this one is the first one. It's not included the other one. It's two separate. Yep. We're going to do, we're going to do them one at a time. Mystery Girl Scout uniforms. Valerie comes in at 29. Susie Q is out. Okay, heavy. I have 30 pound balls like that here. Yes, you do. <laughs> 
Thrifty Santa says, oh, Donna, I need to come teach you how to gift wrap. <laughs> <laughs> right, Santa? All right, let's sell it. Let's sell the first one. 32 to Bolo Buddies. 32 to Bolo Buddies. Girl Scout uniforms. Deborah Smith is out. Valerie. Um, okay, Cliff comes in at 34 and he wants to pay the difference on shipping. Valerie also comes in at 34. 36 would be the next bid. We've got Cliff at 34. Bolo is out. Cliff, do you still have that um, United States address that I can ship to? Didn't you have an address in the U.S. that you can go and um, pick things up, I hope? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> right, James? You do get strange. You should see my neighbors walking by when there's all those packages going out. Yeah, they're um so um I showed them Courtney when I sold them, which was about two or three weeks ago. Their troop leader dresses, their skirts, there's um shirts. Oh, there's a lot of leader stuff too, yes. Yeah, there was leader stuff, there was um white shirts. There was was there some brownie stuff in there too? I don't there remember, was, that's why I was asking. I forgot if there was any brownie there was ties. Stuff um socks there was lots of socks vintage socks little green socks with the um with the thing on them thirty six to valerie thirty six dollars for the girl scout uniforms You remember Sandy? All kinds of stuff. Yes, but I'll pay to ship direct to me. COVID is skyrocketing in the city, and I'd have to go to just change, charge me whatever shipping is minus ten dollars. Okay, Boondock is at thirty-eight. Socks and straps and a brownie skirt. Yeah, see, they remember sashes and badges, and yeah, they remember. Valerie is out. We got Boondock at 38. All right, let's call it to Boondock for 38. Minus the shipping. Everyone, I used to play. I used to play catch with my uh, mailman with the balls too, but he retired. My new mail lady, I don't know her well enough to ask her if she wants to play catch with them. <laughs> I think I actually have a video of it. My mailman was awesome, and she's great too. I mean, I love the new mail. The new mail lady. Let me see if I deleted it. Oh, I deleted it. What a bummer. I did. I deleted that video. I think I put it on one of my videos. <clears throat> Sold to Boondock. Okay. Boondock, I have two. Do you want two balls? Do you want both of them? Or do you want just one? 111 in the chat. Thank you, Jill. Hi, oh, good jump to 114. Cliff, do you want two of them? Hi, Disney Nate. Hi, Denali. Right, Bobby? Let me know, Cliff, if you want both of them for 20. Um, what, did, what, did it, what did it sell to for? 38. 38. So it would cost you 28 plus whatever your shipping is times two. Yes, I have two balls. 
I'll take one. I'm not greedy. Okay. Who else wants the other? Valerie, do you want, let's say offer it to Valerie. She was the backup bidder. Do you want it for 38 Valerie? Okay. That's only fair. Just offer it to her first. Okay. Valerie, do you want it for 38? Donna has bought. Yes, she said yes. Okay. 38 to Valerie. Okay, thank you. All right. Awesome. Okay, so I was going to test this. So while I was sitting here, I discovered something that the Donna loop does that I had no idea that it does. So you can twist it and change the magnification on it. You see, I had no idea that you could even do that. So to determine whether or not, let's see. Okay. So the box says six X. I was ordering another one and ordered the same size. I think. So let's take a look at something and see if the magnification is actually 6x because I can't tell you what the magnification is. So this is closed and that's the magnification on it closed. Now I'm going to open it and we'll see what it does. I'm going to open it. Ooh, it's even better opened. Look at that. That's awesome. Okay, so that's opened. Okay, now this one closed. Okay, so 6X. And then here we go. So opened up is actually even better. Stop wiggling. Open opened up is actually even better. Okay, so this is the this is the loop that Jill won earlier so that's what it is it's a 6x is the one that i have and if anybody's interested please 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 so kindly use my yes, link brandon do tell us huh brandon's asking donna can i share some great news i got yes brandon tell us of course <sighs> Tell us, tell us. Full tuition. Awesome. No way. Hey, Wes. Awesome. Where, where to? And congratulations. That's awesome. Congratulations, sweetheart. Your parents must be so proud. I know how proud I am of my Angelina. That's awesome. Very good. Okay. My next item is going to be these three. They're Alex, Alex and Annie. Is that Anna? Alex and Anna. Is that what they're called? Alex and Annie. Alex and Annie. I'll show you what I have with the loop. So this one, there's four of them. I'm going to start them at 10. So there's that one. They seem to be in very good condition. And then there's this one. It's a private four-year college in Iowa. Awesome. Oh, that's great, sweetheart. That's two. This one is silver. That's three. And this one is four. Tree of Life. This one doesn't have the Alex and Annie 
um, I don't know if it fell off. You guys will have to do search it up and see if it is an actual Alex and Annie or if it's a or if it's a um, knockoff. I have no idea. These are untested, and I I've been told that some of these can be silver, but I did not test these, and I don't know if these come in in actual actual gold. I have no idea. Hey, Don's channel. Hey, well, Don. I'm so you get four of them. You get four of them, and Invisible Bitter is in at 14. They're in great shape. Anybody else? We're going to sell them to Invisible Bitter. Lisa, first one with the hearts. Thanks, sweetheart. Betty Webb, thank you. Thank you, Fancy Pinks. Thank you, sweetheart. Thank you so much. 11 11, it's Denali time. Alex and Annie is going to Invisible Bitter. Thank you, Robin. Thank you, Kelly. Thank you, Kimberly. Thank you, Perlini. Thank you, Invisible Bitter. Thanks, you guys. Thank you, just Jackie. Kalina, thank you, honey. Thank you so much. Steve Vash, thank you. Sandra Killian, I appreciate it. I love seeing the hearts. So pretty. Susan Arrington and Janine, thank you, sweethearts. Thank you. You guys are so kind. Thank you. Thank you, T. Thank you, Mookie. Thank you, Tammy. God, the love you guys show me all the time is unbelievable. My gosh, it's really, really unbelievable. Thank you, 710. Thank you, Talbert's mom, June Bug, Mama G. Thank you, Jen Bennett. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Autumn Grace. Froggy <laughs> with the frogs and the hearts. I love that. That's so sweet. You're welcome, Brandon. I have to go to bed because I have school in the morning. All right, have a great day tomorrow. Thank you, Courtney. Thank you, Devin. Susanna, thank you, sweetheart. Loot Trader, thank you for the heart. Thank you. Oh, thank you, Invisible Bitter. Thank you. I feel the love. Tony Dodge, you're awesome. Thank you. Good night, Brandon. Have a great day at school tomorrow, sweetheart. Susanna, I love your flowers. They're so pretty. Bobby, thank you, honey. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. You're very kind. All right. Sold, sold, sold. Jill, thanks. Joy Munkin, thank you, honey. Going twice to Invisible Bitter for 14. Donna, which loop strength do you recommend? I'm on your link now. Thank you, Loot Trader. Okay, so the number six. The number six is the really big, the big jumbo one that I have. This this is the number six. That's the number six. Um, and then I also have this little one, and I don't remember which one. I kind of just ordered them like random. I, I didn't know, and then I didn't know that they were gonna work as well as they do. So these are the two, these are the two that I own, and these are the two that I use all the time. So they're not that expensive. So you just, you know, try and see which ones work the best for you. Yeah, 6X. Uh, 111 in the chat again. Thank you. Okay, $14 to Invisible Bitter for the bracelets. All right, here we go. How much fireball do they hold? I don't know. Okay, you're gonna start with the number. Th and thank you so much for using my link. I appreciate it. Ruth Bond, thank you, sweetheart. Ruth Bond, you're thank lagging. You. Huh? Ruth Bond, you're lagging. <laughs> um, that's okay. <laughs> that's fine. Don't tell her. <laughs> thank you. Okay. So, all right. So I'm going to show you a lot of plush that I have here. This first one is, um, it's a golf club cover. Um, it's made by a company called Winning Edge. Winning Edge. And it's a, is it a bulldog with playing cards, I guess? That's what it looks like. 
Yeah, with the sun visor, it's really cute, but it's definitely a golf club uh, cover. That's what that one is. This next one is mechanical. Um, I don't know what it does. It doesn't. It needs batteries, but it's a Christmas one. And does it talk? No. And it's a St. Bernard. And it probably sings happy birthday. It's got the mechanism on it. It just needs the batteries. Um, untested. Usually, I mean, I've never had anybody contact me and say something didn't work. But if something doesn't work, just reach out to me and I'll... Um, you know, I'll I'll make good on it. I'll 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 get you something else. This is a cabbage patch. Um, Don't reach out to me. I'm changing my number. Right. I'm kidding. Yeah. This is a 1983 cabbage patch kids, and it's a lion. Um, it looks like the nose is a little bit worn off, but I think this is probably one of the rare ones because of, you know, the color that it is, but it is a cabbage patch. However, it does not say Xavier Roberts on it. So I don't know if this is one of the early, early ones, but it does say cabbage patch kids right on there. So you guys will have to search that up and see what's going on with that one. Here is um, a Build-A-Bear. And I don't remember which um, palace pets maybe this is from. I don't know. Maybe palace pets? I'm not quite sure. He's like, I think I had that. <laughs> Here's another really cute little freckly. Oh, freckly. I know. She has the um, Xavier Roberts. I'm going to start this lot at 25. And she's... Um, She's got the freckles. She's adorable. All right, Joyce, going to start this off at 25. The little freckle one is so cute. And here, um, here's a boy. Here's a little boy. He does have the Xavier Roberts. Sorry about all the nakedness. These, these guys are a lot of naked ones. And this here, I have no idea um, what this is. I feel like I've had I've had this before. Let me make sure I'm not showing something that's sold. It's not. Okay, there's no tag in it. Um, I don't know what this is from. It says us. Oh, here. Let me look at the tag. Unicorn surprises. And I have no idea what's supposed to be inside this pouch. There's no mechanism. And there's nothing that like makes her glow or anything. So you guys are going to have to search that up too and see what that's all about. And this one here is a Build-A-Bear, but it's naked. Just a naked, scruffy Build-A-Bear. You guys, is Build-A-Bear open? Because I know that they were talking about closing during... Um, COVID, when we all got shut down, then somebody said I thought, that they they were, were I thought they were closing permanently. I, I know. Heard. Yeah, I know. But then somebody said that there was one open in their town. This oh. is, I don't know what this is. It's a build a bear. It's got writing on it. But um, do you know what this is with these stripes and that face? Mm. Does anybody know what this is? This could be one of the rare ones. I have no idea. Well, I don't know who he is. All right, so that's the whole lot of plush. So you get this guy. You'll have to figure out who he is. Tasmanian Tiger. Really, Steve Vash? Huh. Okay. Tasmanian. And then so that's two. And the little boy is three. The little freckle girl is four. This Build-A-Bear is five. This unicorn one is six. This really old one is seven. The dog is eight. And the playing card guy is nine. So we have nine pieces. Nine pieces of plush. 
All right. And Joy's in at 25. Any other interest? <clears throat> Let us know for the plush. We're going to sell it to Joy. 50 comes in at 27. We've got Barry in at 27. Oops, sorry, Santa. <laughs> Good to see you, Barry. Thanks for being here. Joy's at 29. In Tampa, it looks like that one of four stores is permanently closed. Oh, but the company's still going. Maybe they just filed chapter 11, not, or chapter set. Which one is the chapter that lets them still run? Okay, we've got Joy 29. Thrifty Santa is out. And we're going to sell it. 29. To Joy. Thank you, sweetheart. That was my lot number 15. Boy, I'm slacking today. Usually by the evening, I'm on like in my 20s. Thank you, honey. All right, T, I'm putting you on. All right, honey. I'm, I'm, I'm starting to clear my desk. So go ahead. It's okay. You, I just, you can put me on. I'm just, I'm just wiping my desk down. And as I wipe my desk down, I'm grabbing stuff. And I'm just the biggest klutz in the world. I'm just the biggest klutz in the world. I don't know. These were sitting on my desk. Let's start them out at 25. If we get high enough, I'll add more. I have stuff all behind me here I can add. <coughs> So these are called roots. Source. This is one of those regaled. It is used. It's one of those room diffusers, parfum, ambiance. It's uh, room fragrance. This is Park Avenue Novair. This is a sample of I Have No Idea, but it is full. These are Victoria's Secrets. We have a Coconut Passion, and we have an Aqua Kiss. So it's a little bit of mixture here, guys. I don't know if that one is, let's see. I think I have some more Victoria's Secrets roots here. Um, the coconut passion, rather. But it doesn't have a label, but it's this. I think it's the same one. I'll throw those in there, too, as well. Um, I actually have two of these, the Park Avenue Novair. I'll put two of those on there, both the same size. All this right, what are we starting this out at? 25 ship. $25. Is anybody interested in the huge perfume lot for $25? The only thing that's not technically perfume and you can use it for yourself is this is a room fragrance, even though it's called Parfume de Ambience. Um, Jill is in at 25. Ruth, I, let me see if I can, I don't always have access to that. Um, I don't know how to access that other let me see if I can do this. I found another one of those. I sold those too. Um, these are... Um, Magical Garden. Uh, let me just read the bottom of this. The first time I saw a sticker on any one of these, I had sold you guys some of this perfume, and I came across some more of it. 
And now this is the first time I'm actually seeing an actual name on one of them. Surround yourself in delicate. So I have these in green and purple. Magical gardens. They have like bling on them. This one doesn't have a sticker. Most of them didn't have a sticker. Um, and then the aqua kisses. Trey's getting very heavy. <laughs> Trey is getting very heavy. Oh, Ruth, I got your message, honey. Thank you. I think this might be another aqua kisses, but I'll throw it in there. It does not have the the name on it. That's cute. That unicorn is supposed to have babies with that. Maybe somebody's looking for just the unicorn and they have the babies to match it up. <laughs> All right, where are we at? Mama G, Jill's at 42. Deborah Reed is out. Judson Smith, let us know, was in at 37. We've got Deborah Reed out, or a stepmom is needed, Donna, right? <laughs> right, so cute. Jill has got the high bid for $42. We're looking for in or out from Judson. Oh, Judson, where are Judson? Thank you. All right, thank you. we're gonna call it to Jill. Forty-two dollars to Jill. We're gonna go thank once. You, and we're gonna go twice. And with a fair warning. We're sold, 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 sold to Jill for $42. Great lot. Congratulations. Are you going to show another lot? All right. I was trying not to get my desk to shake. <laughs> I'm going to see if anybody's interested in some of these shirts. And, and what I'm going to ask you guys, I'm going to just show them really quickly. So because of the lag, I'm going to put a number to the, you know, the items that I show so that you guys can just put in the num in the chat, the number. Perfect. That was not lot number 11, Mama J. What, why has everybody got these white eyed emojis? What's going on? I don't know. Tammy and Robin, did I miss something? All right, don't don't worry about it. We'll figure it out. Do <laughs> do the shirts. Put the number in front. The first person to put the number, like we did it when I was doing my um my five dollar buys. Right, right. Same well, way. That's what this is going to be. Everything is five dollars. All right. These are a pair of dance shorts. Everything is going to be five dollars. If you want them, just put the number one in the chat. These are new, guys. These are not used yep. clothing. These yep, are brand new. new. Brand new. First number one gets the shorts. Size small. Size small. Juniors. Juniors, not kids. Juniors. Teenagers. Do you want to match it up with a shirt? Mama G's. It... All right. So that's number one. All right. All 
That looks like it will fit you nice, Jay. Yeah. <laughs> dance, dance. Number two. First person to put number two for the dance, dance little spaghetti strap top, size medium juniors. Crafted with pride in the United States of America. So USA. Junebug is going to take number two. Do you want to write it down? Yep. You want me to write it down for you, T? And then I'll send you a screenshot of it? Oh, my God. You'd be so wonderful to do okay, that. Okay, I'll do that. Okay, so Junebug gets number two. Number two is Junebug. Make sure you put it on, um, you know, on the clothes. Okay, number three, you guys, the little pink um, sweater that ties on the bottom with the cute little pink rosebud buttons. Number three, we're looking for a number three. This is $5. These are all new. Number three. Okay. Number three to Mama G. Thank you, Mama G. Number three goes to Mama G. Put them in a separate pile, T. The sold okay. ones and the unsold ones. Okay, this one here is going to be a small top, and it's Cavio, and it's Flip Hop Jazz Ballet, and it's number four. Number again, four. Again, this is a small, but it's like a small juniors, juniors. not like a small girl, small juniors. Number four for the tank top. Okay, here's a silky cottony one. It says dance, very um, number five, small, number five for this cute dance one. Five dollars. It's like one of those crappy toppies, you know, like it comes up. Yeah. You know, not for not for me with my tummy, but <laughs> yeah, I could get away with it. Right. <laughs> Me too, Susan. <laughs> hmm. All right. Well, this is All a little right. bit bigger. This one is a women's medium. This is a women's medium. Women's medium. We're looking for number six. Five dollars. Number six. All right, Sandra Killian's going to take it. Number six to Sandra. Thank you, Sandra. Okay, the next one is number seven. It's a skater. First person to put number seven in the chat for skater. Right? <laughs> what Number seven. Okay, we're passing on number seven. Number eight, cheer. Youth 10, size 10. So this would be for like a 10, 12 year old girl who, who wants to be a cheerleader. Number eight for the cheer. I know, Loot Raider, it stinks, right? <laughs> well, she did She did have little boys, like, um, shirts the other night. <clears throat> the marvels and all of that. All right, we're going back to number one because I don't have any more numbers. <laughs> okay, Daddy's Girl is number one. Number one, look at the sparkle on this, you guys. It's so cute. Wait a minute, Perlini wants number seven. Okay. Thank you, Perlini. Okay, Kalina, thank you. Kalina wants number one. Okay.
All right, let's recycle number three. This is awesome. Green tea, size eight. This is number three. It looks like Ed, Ed Hardy stuff. Number three. With all the bling bling and sparkle. Who wants number three? Was number seven sold? Yes. Number seven was sold to you, sweetheart. Perlini, you got number seven. And she wants number eight? Um, What did you say? Did you... Perlini. I see Perlini's got seven and eight. Oh, there. yep, she does. Okay, I didn't write it down. Seven and eight. Got it right now. Okay, okay. number eight, Perlini. All right, let's do another number two. There was no number seven? Yes, there was. Yes, there was. Perlini got number seven. I, did, I, just, I missed number eight completely. I don't know how I got it. Yep, I got it, Perlini. You're seven and eight, honey. Thank you. Look at this purple, you guys. Little girls love purple with those angel wings, and it says love. That's really pretty. You say little girls. To me, it seems a little larger for little girls. It's a medium. It says okay. it's a medium, but again, I think it's juniors or skinny woman's medium. <laughs> yeah. All right, Kalina, Kalina wants number two. number two. All right, Kalina. I haven't seen them, Robin. Do you want to take a, This is adorable. Look at this birthday girl one. This is so stinking cute. What number is this one? Number four. Number four. Number four for the birthday girl, size extra large. Because this is adorable. It's darling. Got little lace at the bottom. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Who wants number four? Five dollars. What a great this isn't gift. Dirt, it's just a piece of lint. Treasure hustlers, they're here. They were just being quiet. Hey, we're Sarah. Here. Oh, thank you. Okay, Perlini's gonna take number. Thank you, four. Perlini. Donna, do you have number three sold on your list? Mama G. Okay, that's what I thought. I just wanted to make sure. Okay. Why don't you take a moment to make a, a bunch more numbers, too? Do you have five or six sold? Um, five was not sold. Six, Sandra Killian bought it. Okay, Sandra Killian. Okay. So you have five available. All right, so we'll do five. Green tea. Eight. It's, it's another size eight. Again, it's juniors. It's definitely juniors. Number five. Is those rhinestones on it? They look like it. Well, are they bumpy? Yes. Yes. Yeah. It's all, you guys, this is all rhinestones. This is so pretty. Is that an R or? Yeah. I think it's for rose or rock because these were with some rose and rock shirts. So <laughs> number five is going to Perlini. All right. Thank you, Lindy. Thank you. That is pretty. All right. Do you have any numbers one through eight that were not sold? I have, let's see, one to Kalina, two to June bug, three to mum and G four to Perlini, five to Perlini, six to Sandra, seven to Perlini, eight to Perlini. Um, I don't have nine. Okay. Let me just grab a nine. This is Cool Princess Rock. Oh, and this also has the oh my gosh how pretty these are so the pretty. on the bottom and this one is also an extra large and so pretty libby Number the name is libby 
Lou. Libby Lou. Susan Arrington's going to take number nine. Okay, Susan, thank you. Okay, go ahead. Sit down and, and make another pile of numbers. Okay. Start 10 through, just see how many, and I'll show something I have right here. You got it, go. While you, while, while you do the numbers. Okay, here, I'll show this. This is a bunch of crucifixes. Robin, look away. I don't want your eyes to burn. <laughs> Robin, look away, Robin. Look away from the light. Look away. Do not look at the computer monitor. Look away. I could actually say that about a few people that are in the chat right now. <laughs> okay. Mama G says, Donna, I have a question. Mama G says, I have a question. Yes, Mama G. not really good when someone says they have a question. Especially when she has it in calves. <laughs> Especially when it's in calves. What did I do? Robin. Robin, you mad? Robin fell asleep. After. Still in calves. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm in trouble. Trouble, I'm in trouble. Okay. Maybe the, you should send Mama Mama G the link so she could come in and yell at you. <laughs> I, I forgot to send her the link actually so she could be in the back room. I forget. I forget. I've, I've done that like two or three times. I stay in caps. Okay. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Some of them are just plastic beads and some of them are really beautiful. <coughs> I'm just going to start these off at $5. There's seven of them. Like, look at this one. This one, this one is really, really pretty. And it's got like this. I don't know if this is wood or it looks like. All right. Susan Arrington's going to start us off at five. And Robin stuff. says that's worse than we need to talk. Uh-oh. <laughs> What's that? Robin says that's worse than we need to talk. I know, right? Robin, is that what I texted you that night? We need to talk. <laughs> Robin. <laughs> Did I do that to you, Robin? <laughs> we need to talk. This is really pretty. It's like um it's like bubbled it's got like a bubbled glass on it some of them say italy on them it's just you know it's just a small lot of crucifixes um this one this one is really pretty this one is like a red one nice crucifix there our virgin mother is there um This one, uh-oh, this one is missing the crucifix, so let me take All right, Invisible out. Bitter came in for seven. Susan Arrington's now at 10. All right, I'm just going to leave that one in there. Maybe you can come across a little cross and put it on, but I just found this. This is like a little bracelet. It says Italy on it. I don't know if it's silver. I didn't even look at it, to be honest with you. Let's look and see together <sighs> what it says. What does it say? I can't, I can't read it. Let me see. It says original. And then it says V-E-D-E-L-E. -E -E, and then it says Italy. So, you guys can look and see if it's silver, but that's cute. It's just, it's a little bracelet. So, that's the whole lot. That's it. That's all I got. All right. Invisible Bitter's in for 12 now. Thank Barb Lee. Do you get your numbers done? 
Yes, ma'am. 17 now from Invisible Bitter. Susan came in at 15. How many numbers did you do? Well, just a couple. I didn't do a lot. Just do like 15 of them. Bang out 15 more shirts. You got 15 shirts sitting there? I have 115 shirts sitting there. All right, well, bang out 15 more shirts. Okay. At least, if not 20. It's Christmas time. They make awesome Christmas presents. Um, okay, so Invisible Bitter, there's the bracelet, the one missing the crucifix. So there's one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But one is missing the crucifix. Eight, and then the bracelet is nine. What is this? Oh my God. What happened? I don't know what this is. What do you mean? I don't know. We're going to open it together. <laughs> so this is the cross. This is the cross. I don't know what it says on the back. We'll look at it in a minute. But it has this little thing on the end. So I'm like, what is this? So I started to unscrew it. Oh, my God. Stop it. And it unscrews. I don't know. It just has a little tiny hole. Is it for ashes? Ashes, for ashes, we all fall down. It's for oil. It's cute. I just noticed it. Shows you how well I look at my merchandise. So yes, yeah, so this is an oil holding crucifix. <laughs> Right? Not ashes. Oil. Cute. I like that. Ashes can't fit in there. <laughs> Tammy's laughing at me. No idea. Gary! 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 Gary. Hi, Gary. How do you know, Susan? Jeez. I'm so tired. Look at how tired I am, you guys. I know. I'm My stomach is growling so bad right now. It's not okay, good. let's sell it. Let's sell it. Oh my God, I can't even say like drugs and crucifix in the same sentence. That would be awful. Is Ronnie here? Ronnie told her. Oh, Ronnie told her. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Just trying to freak Donna out. <laughs> 27 and yeah, Ronnie told me. <laughs> I know because I'm Catholic. I found a hard pendant with a tiny screw like that. Can anyone tell me if it is also for oil? Maybe perfume? I have no idea the rosaries. Let's sell them, sell them, sell them. All right, we got Invisible Bitter at 27. Are you out, Susan? Honey? Tabby says ashes. I think it's for ashes, but... It I'm also can hold um, soil relics from the Holy Land. Yes, Steve. Yeah, dirt from Jerusalem. Basically dirt from Jerusalem. Yes, true. Or holy water. Yes, Mookie. How can you put holy water in that tiny no, little No, not hole? perfume in the cross. She was said she has a heart. She found a heart pendant with a tiny screw in it. 30 from Susan Arrington. Same as ashes. All right, Invisible Bitter is out. We're going to call it to Susan at 30 going once. This one's really pretty. This is wood. This is all wood. Isn't that pretty? And then the, it has the little um, oh, yeah. saints or something. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Pretty. Okay. Less Susan. oil, yes. Susan wants it for 30. Susan Arrington. For $30. 
Thank you, Susan. Robin. Donna. Behave yourself. And how do you know, Robin? Oh, yeah, I may have told her. <laughs> What? Are you ready? No. Why? Why aren't you ready? I will do a few more because I'm starving. You don't. Oh, you don't want to do any more? I made you make all those numbers, and now you don't want to go oh, and do no, any more. I don't want to. I'll do a few. Gary, more. Gary's oh, like, oh boy. boy. It's like not even funny. All right, come on. Let's just do some quick ones. All right, so some, we'll, we'll do a quickie. Yeah, let's do a quickie. <laughs> All right, let's do a quickie. All right, we're going to start from number 10. Yes. All right, this one is Rock Girl. Really cute. Adorable. It is a size extra large. I have to sit down for this. Are we in trouble, Mama G? No. Oh, she didn't say that too positively, did she? <laughs> did you do something? No. Mama G. Bye. Yes, honey. <laughs> okay. Pearl Okay. okay. <laughs> Hold on. I need to get my chat back up. Okay, Me number too. 10, Perlini. All right, we're on number 11. It does make sense, Mookie. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm like at bated breath here for Mama G. Well, I'm trying to figure this out to tell you first. Okay. That's adorable. That's a medium. That's that's a definitely like a, a young, young woman's young, young woman's like teenage medium, and that's number eleven. And you know how I know that because I have a ton of these shirts with Cavio. So yeah. some of them. Let me find another one. Um, some of them just have the size, and then like this one, when it's a girl, it says girl small. Okay. This one doesn't say girl on it it just says yeah saying combed cotton medium and you can see the length on it yes for sure okay so ten dollars five five dollars for number 11 who wants it <clears throat> number 11 five dollars for the dance shirt these are all brand new you guys don't forget if you're leaving to please give a thumbs up on the way out and if you can come back and make a comment, that would help a lot also. This is great. You can see how silky and soft this is. And this one is a size medium. And it's number 12. Number 12. This, on to the me is a woman, this to me is a woman's or it's just meant to be. So, you know, dancers do wear like this loose top over there. Like they wear like this and then put this sometimes over it. So maybe again, it's a junior's medium. I don't know. I'm not a dancer. Right. Yeah. D. It Scott, can be for either. Okay. It's a, it's a crop top, but it can be for either. And basically the girls will wear it over their leotards. All right, and that's okay. that one. Number, this is number... Um, that was 12. Okay, no no one wants 12. All right, how about another skater? This one's going to be... Youth 12. Youth 12 and, and 13. 13 for the skater. 13 for the skater. Spoken like a dance mom pro, Mama G. <laughs> Sorry. Three in dance. 13 to Perlini. 13. Thank you, Perlini. 13 to Perlini. This is number 14. And it is Princess. Birthday, Birthday princess. princess. Birthday Princess. 
Birthday princess is number 14. What size is it? A medium. Medium. Okay. And it's got this sequin bottom. So pretty. Number 14 goes to Perlini. Thank you, Perlini. Thank you, Perlini. Okay. Oh, oh my gosh, Gary. What? <laughs> They're five dollars. Five dollars a piece. Gary, I was thinking about your daughters. They would love these dance, these little dance um, tops. This one's cheer. They're the perfect age, especially the young one. Fifteen for the cheer, and it's a youth eight. All right, we're on 16 now. 16 is going to be the next one. I just have to get up and grab. My girls don't dance. No, that well, I was thinking the birthday one would be adorable for your younger one. They had a skater one, too, a while yeah. ago. Yep, there's a skater. That's really cute. This is number 16 is the skater. They skate and beat each other up. <laughs> oh, here you go, Gary. West Side Gary. Okay. Does he need a matching one? Or are they going to fight? <laughs> what, what size was that one? That was a 10. That was a 10? Do you have one that's a little bit bigger? I don't know if his older girl would wear it. Yes, you heard Mama oh, Jenny, she's in the back. Oh, that's really cool, Gary, for the older for your older daughter. Five dollars. It's number 17. That one. Okay, let's give that one to Gary. Number 17. Okay, number 18 coming up. I think I showed this one already. I don't remember. This is a small. It's girl. It's This one says girl on it. Okay, so for like a... Um, yeah, it's real small. You can see it on me. Yeah. <clears throat> this is probably for like a... What What do you think, Mama G? Five, six? Hello, Elizabeth. Yes. Thanks for coming in, honey. Yeah, you can't even see. Oh, they, maybe if I turn it, you can kind of see how it's. Uh... <clears throat> hey, Elizabeth. And then I don't know if you guys have any interest in. Um... Leotards. 18 to Susan Arrington. 18, 18 to Susan Arrington. Susan Arrington. That's adorable. So this is 19? Yeah. 19 for the shiny leotard. Lot number 19. Five dollars. All right. 19. Susan Arrington. Okay, Susan. Oh, that's cute. Oh, my God. That is adorable. Size six, seven. Let's see the two, two part. <gasps> so cute. Kalina, they're $5. I think and she's no, saying she put she... number 20. She, I didn't even, she didn't even have to tell us. She oh, knew it was sorry. I'm tired. <laughs> number 20 to Kalina. Any more skate? Yes, I have more skate. Oh, these, that's really cute. These are like the short, but like have shorts as the bottom. 
This is, this looks like a bigger size. Yeah, this is a 1214. Hi, Trisha. Thanks for coming in. Hey, Trisha. 1214. Kalina's. <laughs> Love you back, honey. I know. I, I'm sorry. I'm tired. <laughs> I'm like, no, Kalina, it's only, it's only $5. It's not 20. <laughs> she must have been like slapping her forehead. <laughs> you know, it's so funny because I watched the video that Robin made for the um, Black Friday and she put right. me in there slapping my forehead and I'm like, oh, that's so me. She got me like, she always gets me like at the perfect, my perfect moments. <laughs> All right. That's Susan Arrington. Right. Yes. All right, who asked for skater? I can, I can, um, I can do a skater youth ten in purple. Gary had asked for more skater stuff. Okay, youth ten, number twenty two, right? Yes. <laughs> I'm not sure. Somebody help me with this one. This one says medium OS one size, maybe. I don't know. I don't know what medium slash OS would be. Do you have any different skater stuff? Not with me now, but I, guys, I have 50 boxes of this stuff. 50? 50, five, zero. <laughs> oh my God. Are you <laughs> kidding me, T? What are you doing? All right, we'll find some more skater stuff for the girls. Gary, your daughters are probably the little one. The little one's probably like a like a small medium, probably like a six eight, and then the older one is probably like a well 10, 14, maybe 14, 16. Um I would be happy to take email requests. I'd be happy to put a whole box together for somebody if they want. I'll even cut you a deal, like buy so many, I'll give you the next one free. I'll figure out how that's going to work for how me. How many more numbers do you have left? I don't have any more numbers left. No, I, I actually, let's do the two that didn't sell. Let's use those two numbers and then. Okay, show the bags. Okay, so we have number 12 and number 11. I need $10 on the bags. You need $10 on the bags? We'll show the bags. See if somebody wants one for $10. Hey, Lisa. T, did you get Elizabeth's email about the atomizer? She'll look. I'll take a look. And then Painting the Roses Red wants to know if you had any more of those tutus. Yes. You have them available in different sizes. All right, let's do this bag first. Okay, so this bag is ten dollars for the for the big dance bag. Is anybody interested? Ten dollars. I'm gonna write it down on this slip because I'm gonna send her this. I'm gonna send her this slip. Elizabeth's email. And then oh, she fell out. She fell out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I'm exhausted. Look at me. I'm so tired. I had such a busy day. Such a busy day. Okay. You've got Susan Arrington answering yes. I don't know if she's wanting the bag. And then you've got Kalina saying me. Okay. Here she comes. Sorry. Um, I, hit, I hit the wrong button. That's all right. How many of these bags do you have? Well, this is the only bag I have this style. I have different styles. Okay, Susan Arrington's going to get, we're going to call this, put number 11 on it. I do have number 11 on it. Okay, so this is going to Susan Arrington. Okay, and then Kalina was also interested in a dance bag. Can you get that for number 12? Okay. Um, does it have to say dance on it? Do you want something like this? Ooh, sparkles. Ooh, Kalina, that's really pretty. Kalina said no to that. Shelly Tal Tarbit is asking about the bow bag tea. The bow bag. This one? 
Which would have been the ballet one, I think. Yes. Oh my gosh, so cute. Kalina, do you want this one? Or I guess, should we ask Shelly since she asked for that one? Yes, it doesn't have to say dance. Um, do you have more than one of these? I don't. They're all. That's why I said they're all different. There's not one is the same. I don't believe. I I have not come across one of the same. <laughs> Who asked for this one, Mama G? Well, let's just put Sh whoever puts number twelve in here, right? Okay, whoever puts number twelve first. Kalina. Kalina. And poor Junebug says she's been waiting for somebody to, to tell her what number to put in so she can try to get one, too. Who is? Junebug. I need, I wanted the white one. Did I, did I show a white bag? I didn't show any white bags. But no number but was no said. Number was said. But the what? silver one, honey? I didn't have any white bags. The sparkly silver. One. She wants the sparkly the silver one. Oh, June, how about this one, Jumba? You want the backpack one? This is a backpack one. Oh, no, she, she wants, wants this one. I think she wants the other one. That one. This one. Okay. This, this one, June. All right, sold to June. Wait, she hasn't said yes. She hasn't said which one. Yes, she okay. wants it. Okay. Right. That's so the no that. number bag because that's it. I'm out of numbers. Okay, listen. So, you guys, this is what we'll do. Um, one day, not this week, because both T and I are so backed up with shipping. And then we've got to get ready for the marathon and it's Thanksgiving week. But next week, we'll do that $5 sale like I had, like she just did now. We'll do it again. And he will bring a whole bunch of these. We'll try to do it in, you know, the early part of the week. Yes, and, Susan um, Arrington, you want the backpack, honey? You can have it. It's yours. Who? Susan Arrington. The Susan backpack Arrington. one, Susan. Okay, sparkle bag to June bug. And then sparkle backpack. To Susan Arrington. I got everything written down for you too. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, guys. Yeah, we'll do a whole day where I can just bring a whole box and we'll do it like this with the number, you know, where we just it'll make it'll make it so much easier. I, I hate to be a party pooper and I appreciate you guys purchasing. I cannot tell you my stomach right now is like in <laughs> Oh, I know. And look at me, T. I'm exhausted, honey. I'm so tired. Like we, you know, Sundays is 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 a lot for us. And, and plus we were on last night and Friday night. And so you guys, I just want to thank everyone so much. I still have 90 people in the chat. Thank Mama you guys. Janine, you guys awesome. Janine, thank you so much, sweetheart. And, um, and Mama G, thank you. And thank you everyone that came out and hung out with us tonight. And we will be back on Tuesday night on my channel. We're taking tomorrow, just shipping all day tomorrow. Um, and thank you, Woodbine Girl. Thank you. That means a lot. Mama G, what's the question? Oh, Janine wants to know what the question is. Are you gonna I'm going to wait until after because I know I'm just going to have to watch the video again, to be quite honest. Okay. Oh, it's a mistake about the numbers? We'll talk about it. Good night, okay. everybody. All right. It's not so bad. We'll figure it out. Um, it's not bad. Sandy Kirk is having a colonoscopy on oh, Wednesday. Wednesday. Oh. oh, yeah. Sandy, you'll do fine. It's not that bad. Joy Munkin, good night, sweetheart. Good night, everyone. <laughs>
You'll do fine. You, it's quick. Farmer, hey, farmer. Why are you leaving every time I show up. <laughs> farmer, because you're um, late, farmer. It's we've been here hours. two and a half hours, buddy. We've been here two and a half hours. <laughs> That's not true, Robin. That's not true at all. Don't start rumors. Good luck with your surgery as well, Sandy Kirk. Good luck with the colonoscopy. Hope everybody is okay. Kalina, you'll do fine with the cataract surgery. They, they've they come so far with it. Two, three days of discomfort. Thank you. And you'll and you'll be back to normal. And you're going to be so happy because Kelly. those rings are going to be gone. And everything's going to look back down to normal. It's going to be awesome. You're going to be so happy that you did it. Um, guys, don't forget Wednesday night, Kelly the Garden is coming on with us. She's going to walk us through the app from start to finish. So stay tuned for that. And Donna and I, we're going to play it by ear on Tuesday. We're going to see how it goes because we do have to plan the big weekend. So Donna will make a decision about Tuesday, probably not till Tuesday where we see where we're at. Yeah. Yes. Shipping for sure all day tomorrow. All right. Thanks, everyone. Love you. Okay, Love Susan Arrington. I will, honey. Thanks I have all your stuff. Have a big Susan Arrington pile. It's all good. <laughs> Night, Tammy. Thanks for another great evening. Thank you to everyone that bought from us. I'm not going to shower next time before I show up. Then maybe they won't leave. Bye, Farmer. Bye, Farmer. Bye, Good night, Steve Bash. Bye, Gary. <laughs> Thank you so much, everyone. Appreciate you.